Welcome. In this video, we will discuss about how the fund allocation has been enhanced for the SARDP Northeast, which is your special assistant road development program, specifically for Northeast region. Now, which ministry is the nodal agency which has increased the fund? It is your Ministry of Road Transport and Highway. So, this is basically in news because the fund allocation has been enhanced for the Northeast region. So, let's begin this video and try to understand. So, Ministry of Road Transport and Highways has enhanced the allocation of funds for expenditure under Special Accelerated Road Development Program in Northeast areas or what is called as SAR-DPNE related to the works during the 2020 financial year. So, that is why it was in use the fund allocation has been increased for the accelerated development of road in the Northeast region. Under the revised allocation, almost double the amount originally allocated has been allowed. So, it is like a huge bust or a huge boost to the overall project of road development in Northeast region. It kind of doubled the amount which was originally kind of allocated for the development of Northeast region. Additionally, the allocation of national highways in Northeast region under 10% mandatory pool fund has been on an upward route in the last five years. So basically what all this is means that India like the present government is very much dedicated to increase the connectivity in terms of road in the Northeast region. So we know that Northeast region is like connected to the mainland India through chicken neck. So this is our Northeast region and it is like this is the only part which is located in India. So this particular chicken neck which is called as the Siliguri Corridor is the one which uh, kind of connect the Northeast India with rest of the mainland. So hence it's become very important that this particular part is well connected and the road development is also properly taken over there. This particular region is also the region of Eastern Himalayas and hence the topography of the region is bit uh, rough. And that's why it took more effort. And in fact, there are many regions where border road organization, your BRO is the one which undertake the process of development of road. Government of India has undertaken massive road development program under SRDP NE scheme in the Northeast region. So particularly this SAR DP NE scheme is the one where the government has tried to put its fund allocation so that fast accelerated road development could take place in the Northeast region. So this is the basic detail because of which this particular topic was in news. Now let's also try to understand what the SAR DP NE is. So basically it is an ambitious project taken up by the Ministry of Road Transport and Highways for development of road network in the northeastern states of country. This program envisages providing road connectivity to all district headquarters in the northeastern region by minimum two lane highway standard apart from providing road connectivity to backward and remote areas areas of strategic importance and neighboring countries. So just what is the scope of this SRADP NE? So basically SRADP scope it includes that at least at district headquarter. Every district headquarter there should be road connectivity and also in its, its scope it includes the remote areas, the areas which have a strategic importance or the area where which uh, the, it shares with the neighboring country. So we also the northeastern country share the border with neighboring countries like your China, Bangladesh and Myanmar. Desh and finally Myanmar. So these are the three countries in which the northeastern state share borders. So the connectivity between these is also one of the thing which is taken into consideration while going for the SARDP Northeast. Program planned in two phase A and B including Arunachal package, phase 1 is under progress and phase B is in the conceptual state. So basically Arunachal Pradesh is the one which has been into high rise and it, uh, like I had the chance to go to Tawang and it was actually very good connectivity. So uh, Tawang has good roads and it is it gets connected to the India-China border. So this uh, SRDP NE program has actually increased the road connectivity of Northeast region. 
The objective of this scheme was threefold. It was development of interstate connectivity so that like from Assam to Arunachal, from Meghalaya to Assam, all these kind of interstate connectivity is taken into consideration. Then development of access connectivity to the international border as mentioned uh, just now that uh, international, the neighboring countries, the location, the connectivity to them is also needed. And finally, development of connectivity to district headquarters from the nearest national highways. So that is also one of the things. So there were three main criteria. One is interstate connectivity, then connectivity to the neighboring countries through the border roads. And finally, also the district headquarters of each state needs to be connected. So this is the major threefold objective under which RDP NE was organized. Now when we are at this topic just try to like this map is actually very important like this is India's map you should know. So this is what I was referring to. So India is connected to North East through this chicken neck or what is called a Siliguri corridor. Then over here we have China and I forgot Bhutan is also a country with, with which this northeastern state share its border. Then you have Myanmar over here. Bangladesh. So these are the neighboring countries through which the northeastern state share its border. So you have to remember the geographical location of these as well as which state share border which with international uh, country. So that is one thing that you need to know. So I hope you have understood this video. If you have any doubt, feel free to drop a comment. Thank you.